Okay, welcome back. So now we are doing a problem on optimum number of rain gauges. One area, one basin, le. The basin no rain, but in catch when they are no rain, but area, one village, other panchayat, or like one dam lake, or la dam lake, but like that, like catch when they are no rain, but area, but that area, le, how many rain gauges minimum there? Okay, that is. Optimum rain gauges. Okay, so to find optimum number of gauges, we denote it by n. N is equal to it is given by C V by small letter P whole square. Okay, where P is allowable error in rainfall in percentage percentage then substitute you can substitute in percentage itself and cv is coefficient of variation of coefficient of variation of rainfall Okay, so for finding CV, CV is given by SX divided by X dash into 100. Okay, note it, note it, more. SX is standard deviation. मैं मैक्स ली पढ़ चुका हूँ डिविएशन सो वे सिग्मा ना जी बढ़ने लगा सो एसएक्स इक्वेशन इस इट्स इक्वेशन इस गिवन है एसएक्स स्क्वायर और सिग्मा स्क्वायर इन सम टेक्स्ट बुक्स एसएक्स स्क्वायर इस इक्वल टू सिग्मा एक्स आई माइनस एक्स डैश होल स्क्वायर डिवाइड बाय एन माइनस वन Sigma 1 to n, i is equal to 1 to n. Okay. So Sx will be equal to root of this expression. Okay. And x dash is mean value, average, average of rainfall values. Okay. So we have optimum number of rain gauges. This is the final equation. C by P. To P will be assumed later on. C V is coefficient of variation of rainfall, and that is given by S X by X dash into 100, where S X is standard deviation. S X is equal to this expression. All root of sigma i to n i 1 to n x i minus x dash whole square divided by n minus 1. Okay, so coming back to question, we have four values 105, 79, 70, and 66. So we know that value of n is equal to 4. There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 rain gauges. From those rain gauges, you have to find out you have to find out how much more or how much less we need more rain gauges in that basin okay so right now there is only four rain gauges n is equal to four so we will be going from bottom to top in this order of equations so average value x dash is given by mean value okay 105 plus 79 plus 70 plus 66 divided by n okay and that is 80 okay so x dash we substitute here so it will be an elaborate equation
is x is equal to root of whole root of one not five minus eighty square plus seventy nine minus sorry eighty square plus seventy minus eighty whole square plus sixty six minus eighty whole square divide by n minus one four minus one three okay so after calculating that we got the s six value standard deviation value as Seventeen point five three. Okay. So again, substituting back S X on seventeen point five three, and we have X dash as eighty, and is equal to seventeen point five three divided by eighty into hundred. That is equal to. Twenty one point nine one. So CV is twenty one point nine one. Then again, substitute back CV twenty one point nine one divided by P is allowable error. Okay. So if P is not given in your question. Assume it as ten percentage. Ten percentage error is allowable. Okay. So whenever there is no P value given in your question, just assume that ten percentage error is allowable. So, so just put that value, percentage value, instead of uh, fractionalizing or anything. Twenty one point nine one divided by ten whole square. Okay. So n gives you four point eight. Okay, so that is we round it as five rain gauges. Rain gauges. Okay. So optimal number of rain gauges. The value is the answer is. Five number of rain gauges. Currently, there are one, two, three, four, four rain gauges. Okay. So we need to install one more. Our question is find the number of additional rain gauges required at the basin. So right now we have one, two, three, four rain gauges. So the optimal number is five. So the additional number of rain gauges required is. Four minus five minus four, one. Okay. Number of additional gauges is equal to five minus four. That is equal to one rain gauge. So that is the answer. We need to install one more rain gauge to the basin. There were four. Optimal number is five. So we had to add add one more rain gauge. Okay. So we will just uh, go through it again. We had four rain gauge values in centimeters. So we had to find out number of additional optimal number of rain rain gauges. And exactly we had to find out. What number of additional gauges you have to install? Okay, so the equation was n is equal to CV by P small letter P whole square. CV was coefficient of variation of rainfall. It was SX by X dash into hundred. SX was standard deviation. SX was is equal to sigma I one to n X I minus X dash whole square divided by n minus one whole root. Okay, that was standard deviation. X dash was 
average of rainfall values average of rainfall values were taken from all these four values as 80 they were substituted in the equation of sx and we got sx as 70.53 substituted back into cv equation we got cv as 21.91 substituted back to the n equation cv square cv by p whole square we got 4.8 we rounded it into 5 so 1 extra rain gauge is required okay so try to do it at home and also try to practice one more problem i am giving you just now okay thank you